After a massive natural gas rate hike was approved last year, experts have been looking into Chicago's home bills and how the extra money is being used. CBS2 investigator Megan Hickey joins us live. And Megan, I know you've been digging into the latest information about whether these hikes are worth it. Right, Jim and Marie, the primary reason for last year's $300 million rate hike is an expensive gas pipe replacement program that some experts are now recommending be scaled back so that it's more cost effective. Beneath Chicago streets are nearly 2,000 miles of deteriorating natural gas pipes that can pose safety risks like leaks and explosions, prompting people's gas to spend billions of dollars on what's known as the safety modernization program to replace them and in return sending gas gas bills climbing. Recently, the state paused spending on the program until an investigation could determine if it was worth it. Last night, the Illinois Public Interest Research Groups, the Attorney General's Office, the City of Chicago, and other stakeholders filed expert witness testimony. They found that uh, People's Gas is prioritizing non-safety factors in the work it's doing, which it shouldn't be doing on a safety program. Bottom line, they don't have a, 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 an accurate way of knowing where the safety risks are and correcting that in a cost-effective manner. I think there's going to be a, a pretty big impact to the system because they paused it when they did, not knowing what this winter may bring us. And supporters of the current safety modernization program, like the Gas Workers Union, worry that a permanent scaling back will impact the reliability of their system. We'll have much more on the debate coming up at 6 on CBS2. For now, live in the newsroom, Megan Hickey, CBS2 Investigators. See you at 6, Megan. Thank you.